This is the first time that I guess DHE is really kind of packed and preparing to fire a, a kiln for uh, in honor of Winter Carnival, but I feel like it's very appropriate. You know, we, we, we just got a whole bunch of snow on the ground. We had, I just had to clear a spot outside so that we actually have some room for this. Having been here last year for Carnival and having pretty dismal amounts of snow as of no snow, it was nice to get some coverage and, you know, really feel like, you know, it is north of New Hampshire, it is Dartmouth, and um, it's really winter wonderland out there. So. I, I think the storm was perfect timing for Winter Carnival. It was awesome looking outside yesterday and seeing the snow coming down and, uh, you know, just seeing the, the snow sculpture out in the green. This is the pyrolysis kiln that the Bioenergy Project has recently completed. But essentially what we've got here is going to be a system for making charcoal uh, very efficiently and very cleanly. Most charcoal that's, that's made for the purposes of cooking fuel, it's often made um, in very inefficient, very dirty ways that produce lots of emissions and don't really make a lot of charcoal. Biochar, when mixed with fertilizer, kind of begins to act as almost an underground coral reef that acts as a kind of medium for nutrients and water to be suspended underground. And that means that you have a much more effective fertilizer, you can use less water, you have an underground like microbial ecosystem that sustains nutrients, and it's much better for your ecology.